At one point, he tells us that Molly grabbed a hold of her phone and said, you need to leave me alone, I'm gonna call the police. And then she took off running. He in turn chased her down. And then he tells us that at some point in time, he blacks out. And then he comes to near an intersection in which we believe he then placed Molly. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Are you sorry? 24-year-old Christian Rivera appearing in an Iowa courtroom Wednesday charged in the kidnapping and murder of University of Iowa student Molly Tibbetts. The 20-year-old went missing while jogging in the city of Brooklyn on July 18th, prompting a massive month-long search. On Tuesday, Rivera told police he followed Tibbetts in his car while she was out jogging that July morning and eventually got out to run beside her. He went on to reveal that he put Molly's body inside his trunk before burying her underneath corn husks in a nearby field. Molly's murder heating up the immigration debate across the country with the revelation that Rivera is an undocumented immigrant. We got to stop politicizing this issue and fix it once and for all. Tibbetts' murder drawing comparisons to the death of Kate Steinle, who was shot and killed by an illegal immigrant on a San Francisco pier in 2015. This is Kate Steinle 2.0, and if we had a wall, Molly Tibbetts would be going to college in a couple of weeks as she should be. It's heartbreaking. If convicted, Rivera faces the possibility of life in prison without parole. In Iowa City, I'm Willie James Inman, Fox News.